Hey guys, so it's actually Thursday today, but I wanted to show you guys my outfit because I'm like pretty proud of it or I really like it. Um, this is my new coat from Eileen Fisher. It is amazing. It doesn't have, it's kind of like just like a, I would say like a longer style, like blazer style coat. It doesn't like tie or anything, but I'm like absolutely in love with it. I don't know if you can really, it's the thing about the lighting in this room. I don't know if you guys can really pick up on all of the little details. It's like tweed with like gray and black. It's really nice. I love it. And I like, if you guys want it, you should get it because it's on sale. Also comes in the light gray, which I like ignore my like laundry because I haven't had time. Put it away. Kendra Scott necklace I've been wearing a ton. I really like this. It's like such a nice layering piece. And I'm wearing this loft top. Haven't worn in a while. A Madewell skirt, tights, and the coach boots. So just a little bit different than I usually wear. I just wanted to show you guys like Fridays, I don't really ever do like a lot of meetings, so that's why I'm like always pretty casual. Like two meetings today, so I wanted to show you guys like what I also wear when it's more, like I have to be a little bit more dressed up for work. All right, well, I don't think I'll vlog anymore today, but I'll see you guys tomorrow in Friday for the weekend vlog. So I'm so tired, I'm gonna do two of these espressos. I'm also gonna make some avocado toast with Ezekiel bread. So I'm running a little bit late because I have a car appointment and I forgot about it until I just checked my planner. So um, I just wanted to show you guys quickly my outfit. This sweater, I've like been wearing it so much. It's the Leaf sweater. I believe it's sold out, um, unfortunately. Uh, from Nordstrom, Kendra Scott necklace, Hermes, um, Lulu leggings, and the coach boots. Literally guys, I wear the same stuff like over and over again, but I am gonna wear my new coat that I showed you guys yesterday on Thursday, so bye bye. So dreary, I hate this weather. Oh, I'm on my way to the car dealership. Um, I just need to get my key battery replaced. Um, they're gonna check my speakers cause they're like really high pitched. I don't know what could have happened to them. Um, they're gonna wash it because they always do that and what else are they gonna do? Um, change my oil. This week went by like super fast. Um, I think I'm gonna get a pedicure after work. I'm on like a two-day rest from the gym because I hurt my foot unfortunately so I was I didn't have my trainer last night because he thought let's just rest it and see how it goes because it's like the balls of my feet and it really hurt the other day like I think I was just like too much impact and jumping on it it's not like I I think I just like increased my physical activity by a lot so your body's like what the hell you know like especially if it's like something you're using a lot like the the, the bottom of your feet I feel like I rolled it a little bit it feels a lot better today because I didn't work out yesterday and I was gonna push myself to do it but I was like you know what I feel like I shouldn't I just like get frustrated because like I want to work out and I like, you know, I don't know. It's just like annoying. Like I don't want to get injured, but what my friend was saying, she's like, be careful because if you like keep going and injure yourself more, you're gonna have to take like a month break from working out. Hell no, F that. This week flew by. I had so many damn meetings. Like sometimes like I'll have like only like one or two meetings during the week, like with other people, you know? I always have meetings, like internal meetings don't count. I had so much this week. Like I literally had a lunch Monday, Wednesday, Thursday, and today, what am I doing? No, today I don't have a lunch, but, um, but yeah, it's just like crazy. And then we're here Monday and then Tuesday we leave for Atlanta, my boss and I, so I'm going to drive us, um, cause we're, we're close. We usually fly obviously when we're going to like our market visits. It's our first market visit of the year. Um, so I'm excited. Uh, it'll be good. We have some really good meetings lined up, so hopefully that will we'll get some traction. It's like a mix of uh, current clients, past clients, prospective clients.
so I'm driving in my sister's car. Oh, I'm about to drive in my sister's car. And she's literally, I mean, she's not that much shorter than me. And I'm like on top of the wheel. She's going to kill me. I'm going to have to move this a little bit. So uh, my car's still not ready. I dropped it off at like 930 this morning and it's not ready. <laughs> so I found a better spot to put you in and I'm not looking at you guys at all. <laughs> but um, yeah, so I decided I'm gonna go to this place called Crisp. It's like a make your own salad place. I used to go there a lot more, but I'm not, I haven't really been going there that much because I like this other make your own place salad place. Make your own salad place more. <laughs> um, and it's just further away. I don't know why I, I never really come here. My sister has the Evoke Range Rover and it's a really nice car, but I just never like drive it unless we're like driving to Atlanta or something and then we like share the ride. Literally had the best salad. Like, I don't know, they've done a few changes in there since I've last been there and the chicken was so good. It was like delicious, like roasted, grilled, so good. It tasted like had like you know when it's like grilled on like a real grill? It's like grilled chicken tastes so good. I went to Starbucks and I was like, I always like, every time I go to Starbucks, I call my sister. I'm like, do you want something? Um, so I called her and she was like, yes, I want a Frappuccino. It's less than 30 degrees outside. So I was like, Natalie, no, that's ridiculous. And she was like, I don't care. It doesn't matter to me. <laughs> she didn't care. It was ridiculous. <laughs> so um, I got her a Frappuccino. So I'm like looking like a crazy person with the Frappuccino. And you know I love iced coffee, but when it's this weather, like I don't get iced coffee. When it's like in the 40s, I'll, I'll do it, but not when it's like 30 degrees and I'm freezing. Um, but I got a flat white, which I really like flat whites. They're really, really good. It's kind of like, if you've never had one, like a, like a creamier, like a more silky frappuccino. They're so good, so good. And they do a really good job at this. This Starbucks is like the least friendly Starbucks. If you're in Charlotte, it's the one in Elizabeth next to Chris. Um, they're just like very not friendly there. Like, I don't know why I'm like, honey, I've never done anything to you, but they make the best drinks. Every time I get Starbucks there, like it's the best. They're just like, have really good baristas. But the guy who, I think he's like the manager. He's like not nice. And I'm like always really nice. Like I'm always like so polite and he didn't, didn't, he never appreciates my politeness. Ooh, this flat white's so good. It's so good. It's like three o'clock already. I took less than an hour for lunch, go me. Well, I will update you guys probably after work because I have a lot of stuff to do at the office before um, the end of the day. And then hopefully I'll get my car at some point. He was like, it'll be done today. I was like, better be done today. Like, I'm not like asking you to replace the engine or something like there's really nothing wrong with it oh so much traffic all right bye just leaving work on friday well natalie's been so nice and is driving me to the dealership oh it's brisk you're like it's really complicated sorry <laughs> you're like what's complicated you turn. <laughs> that's it I was like, I went through the neighborhood and turned, it, turned around. What was complicated? And I never lied to admit that I was wrong. If you like the way you love that much, oh baby, you should. Can I show my vlog the bottle? Just opened some lovely Pinot Noir. It is this one. Oh, did, are you chilling it? Are you chilling it? Yes, I am. Fire and flood. My parents discovered it in Las Vegas. Yummy. Sea bass. Yeah, eat. Eat it up. I need to heat yours up again. Mm-hmm. Okay. Because it's Mom, you can I cut them. Huh? No, it's not. Yo te los pa puedo parte. partir. <laughs> Good morning, guys. It is Saturday. It's a beautiful day. It is 38 degrees, but oh well. It's sunny and it's beautiful. 
Um, I'm just driving to back to my apartment from 11:11. Make a wish. I have my trainer at 11:30. Stayed at my mom's place last night, and yeah, we had a really fun time. We watched Crimson Peak. It was really like bad. I was like, it was kind of like, I don't know. It was just like a very freaky weird movie. It's a Guillermo del Toro movie, but I don't know. It was just kind of weird. Literally so excited to eat. I have some sriracha coffee because I need a um, water and then this chili sauce with garlic and I'm watching some Kayla Lachey. I don't really watch her that often, but um, I find her vlogs pretty entertaining. So yeah, sorry, I don't know why I was like looking over there when I'm over here. <laughs> All right, bye. Hey guys, so I'm not wearing any makeup because that's what the facialist told me to do. No makeup, I just have like moisturizer on, but I just wanna show you guys my casual outfit. I'm wearing my Burberry scarf, the Eileen Fisher coat that I'm literally obsessed with, guys. Like. You guys need it. I can't tell you how many times you need it. It's awesome. I'm wearing this Vince cashmere sweater, some leggings, and these shoes are from Massimo Dutti. I got them in Spain. And yeah, I need to wear flats because of my foot. Uh, but yeah, I packed another bag because so I'm going to stay with my mom again tonight. I Guys, my skin looks amazing. I'm so happy. I did this. It's a little greasy right now because she put like moisturizer and sunscreen. Wow. That was awesome. I highly, highly recommend the Hydra Facial. Oh my God, I love it so much. My skin feels like it's never felt before and all my pores are gone. Oh my Lord, it is like amazing. And I got like a 20% off because it was my first time. So it was like even less expensive than I had anticipated. Time to get a juice. I'm excited. I need some kale in my life. I've decided one of my biggest like dilemmas in life is like when I'm vlogging and also snapchatting I always forget one or the other um, but I if you don't follow me on snapchat I'm always snapchatting like during the week too so in case you're like oh my god I need to see what Pam is up to you can follow me on snapchat <laughs> and I'll follow you back just like let me know who you are but I'm gonna head to the mall and my mom's gonna meet me there in like an hour or so and I need to start dress shopping. Ugh, is there anything worse? No, there is. Okay. There's two things that are worse. Jean shopping and bathing suit shopping. And then it's dress shopping because I just don't have great luck when it comes to dresses. I think he's telling me that... Can find something? We're good.
Le pregunto a Nati. Mm -hmm. I'm laughing because I was like trying to vlog and I took a picture of myself and I'm like um, I look a hot mess but look at my skin you guys it looks like it like is a new layer of skin like it feels like you know when you touch a baby's skin like it feels like that it's amazing but anyways uh, my mom and I are gonna go to mass um, so we have to get ready kind of fast I need to like wash my hair and do something about this but I wanted just to say that I really like the um, effects of the hydrofacial and she cleared out all of my pores so she said I might get like a little bit of like I feel like right there like a little bump but it'll go away and it's like just clean cleanse out all the impurities and everything but all right let's get ready I wanted to show you guys my makeup that I did today it's very like simple but I like it a lot hopefully this lighting is okay um, let me show you my little stash. This is pretty much my everyday makeup. I mean, I feel like I've talked about all of this like 10 million times. Um, what am I? This is like my favorite base, the It Cosmetic CC Cream plus Bobbi Brown foundation stick to like correct anything. Um, NARS Creamy Radiant Concealer. I didn't use the Makeup Forever one. I don't even know where it is. Um, for eyeshadow, I used. Coco Mirage, and also this, these two in Orchid Haze. I love these so much. They're so pretty. Uh, oh my shadow sticks. I used the Charlotte Tilbury um, Bronze and Glow for bronzer. And then this for contour, the Dolce Gabbana blush in tan. And I like that for bronzer or blush. I set everything with this since um, I didn't bring my Laura Mercier powder, but it's really cute. And then, um, or it's really cute, what am I talking about? It works. Chanel Jersey, the Blur Primer from YSL, and then like, the Clinique Mascara and Too Faced Mascara. And that's all I used for makeup. So I'm all ready for mask, but I wanted to show you guys what my mom got me for Valentine's. It's so cute. Look at that, Infinity necklace it's so so beautiful i'm obsessed with it um and i got myself a treat yesterday too this kendra scott necklace i've been wanting um i can't like find a full length mirror so i'll just show you guys what i'm wearing I'm wearing the skinny jeans from seven vince camuto booties this silk blouse is from uterque in spain and that's pretty much it kind of simple for v-day and oh, i'm walking around aim aimlessly around the house but let's go to mass so I just got to Harris Cedar I just dropped my mom off at the front um, it is so freaking cold like it is 31 degrees which I know if you live like in the north or something it's not that cold for you guys but for me it's really really cold I'm like freezing and I don't have like a proper jacket on um but we're gonna go to the grocery store and then I think I'm gonna drop her off and then go I need to go home and like do laundry and stuff and then we're gonna all have dinner my dad's on his way to Charlotte and I think we're all gonna have dinner tonight so that'll be nice we had a really good brunch at this place called Cork Buzz it was so so good um, but yeah, all right, let's go to the grocery store. Cocktail? Yeah, and the lump crab meat cocktail. Okay. Shrimp cocktail and crab meat cocktail? Yes, please. Okay. Are you going to have salads later? I guess. I wanted a piece of cheese. We have papers. Happy Monday, guys. It is so cold outside, and I didn't end the vlog last night, so I wanted to just vlog a little bit this morning before I get to work. Um, I have the Eileen Fisher jacket. I'm wearing like 10 layers. I'm wearing a like layer underneath this. I don't know why. So I'm wearing this like long sweater that I got in Spain. Um, this like big blanket scarf because I'm going to wrap myself 
around this in the office and act like an Eskimo. Leggings and Tory Burch booties. I'm so cold already. So I wanted to show you guys like snacks that I bring to the office. Well, I haven't had breakfast because um, I should have, but I didn't. But I'm going to eat those two hard-boiled eggs that I made earlier this week. Um, these are the raw, unsalted almonds from Trader Joe's, the light string cheese, and some berries. Um, I won't finish all of those, but I'm going to Atlanta tomorrow, and I want to like finish these before I have to leave, and then they go bad. So, it's now Monday afternoon, and I realize I still haven't finished the vlog. Just had like a crazy day so far. The heat was off in our office. Did I even explain that? Like, I got to the to the office this morning and my sister was like let's go buy space heater so I went I went to Target and got some space heaters and apparently it's like the whole building that lost heat and it's 30 degrees outside so it's definitely not okay um but I wanted to update you guys quickly like my skin is like amazing from this hydrofacial to be honest I don't have problematic skin but the hydrofacial made it like 10 times better I don't know it just looks super glowy super like clear and just perfect so I decided I'm gonna get it with the NARS velvet matte skin tint I was really trying to hold off on buying a new foundation but I'm gonna go for it since I love the way it looks and I've had the sample I'm almost out of the sample and like when you finish a sample like it means like you really like it um, and a little goes a long way with it it's super easy to blend in um, and like that I think like the first time I used it I maybe used it a little too much so it was a little cakey looking so just be careful um, and I have been wearing it with the like YSL primer that I showed in my latest haul um, and I really have been enjoying the way it looks that's what I'm wearing today and I just feel like it looks really nice and it still looks like your skin um, and it has SPF and all of that. I'll probably get that um, in Atlanta this week. I might vlog my trip. I don't know. I need to figure out. Uh, I probably won't actually. So watch. Um, keep up with me via Snapchat because I'll Snapchat like in case I get it. And I'll talk about it in my next weekend vlog and all of that. Um, I just feel like I've been vlogging a lot. So I need like some days to just like. Psh, like. Thank you guys for watching. I'll talk to you guys another day. Bye.